G'day there, Eric Backer, naturopath, author of Candida Crusher. This is our frequently asked question series. I have diabetes, Eric. Is this the reason I got a yeast infection? Well, it could well be. As you know, diabetes, we call diabetes a blood sugar problem. So there are two types of diabetes, but the common one which many people come to me with is type 2 diabetes. So type 2 diabetics uh, can generally take medicines to regulate their blood sugar and it, providing they eat the right food and look after their body weight they can usually keep it at bay. Type 1 diabetes however is insulin dependent and autoimmune disease. It's, it's a different ball game we're talking about. So I'm referring to type 2 diabetes here. So diabetics can increase or have a higher amount of glucose output in their urine and this can predispose many people towards uh, uh, vaginal yeast infections or females to vaginal yeast infections. So this is something that you need to bear in mind. If you get recurring vaginal infection and you're a diabetic, you need to get your blood sugar sorted properly. There are different blood tests you can do to determine you know, whether you've got a problem short term or long term. So you, you want to best talk to your doctor about these particular tests and make sure that you've got your blood sugar under control if you want to prevent you know, these further outbreaks. But I have also seen diabetics with skin manifestations of yeast infections around the armpits, in the groin, uh, around the feet area. So, and this also can be due to a higher blood glucose level. Uh, and we know that candida yeast infections feed on, on uh, sugar. So if you've got continually high blood sugar, uh, if you've got high urinary output of glucose, you can certainly predispose yourself uh, to manifestations uh, of yeast infection if you've got diabetes. So this could be a reason. So, and I've also seen some diabetics uh, actually being diagnosed with diabetes after the doctor discovered they had a, a chronic vaginal yeast infection, which led to blood testing. So that's another thing that you may want to think about. So to answer your question again, is my diabetes the reason I've got a yeast infection? It could well be. Get yourself checked out. I hope that answers your question.